Welcome to the Aussie Results Show. Sam Stoza's winning run at the Sony Ericsson Open in Miami has come to an end today. Stoza went down in the quarterfinals against Kim Clayster's 6-3, 7-5. Despite the loss, Stoza will remain in the top 10 when the new rankings are released on Monday. Sam Groth has scored an upset first round win at a challenger event in France. After coming through qualifying, Groth beat 8th seed Jan Hernich of the Czech Republic in straight sets. His wife Jamila Groth didn't fare so well in Spain though. She was forced to retire in the third set of her second round match at a $75,000 event in Monzon. The boys and girls top seeds have both made a winning start at the Optus 14's National Clay Court Championships in Ipswich. South Australian Bradley Mousley had a straight sets win over Alec McKenzie, while local girl Ashley Barty didn't drop a game in her second round win over Sion Mendes. Coming up, Sophie Ferguson and Monique Adamzak kick off their campaigns at a $25,000 ITF event in Alabama. Sam Groth competes for a quarter-final berth against world number 187 Igor Sizzling on the challenger circuit, while Bryden Klein, Caden Hensel and John Millman will fly the flag at a futures event in the States. That's all for us today. Check back on tennis.com.au next week for more Aussie results.